All right, this is Corduroy. I'm at Barber Park again today. And this is the first plug that I dug, and I pulled up a wheat penny. Not sure of the date, but uh, it's a good sign. All right, I'm at what well, I think is going to be a good target. You can see how it's kind of jumping around on the E-Track, 240. And it's about, I don't know, it's over the halfway mark on the gauge on the right there. So I'm thinking maybe seven, eight inches down. It's 1843, 140. This is uh, the same thing that that wheat penny just did that I dug up. So I'm thinking maybe it's another wheat penny. So well, I'll dig it and we'll see. All right, so you can kind of see it in the bottom of the hole. It looks like it's not going to be another wheat penny. I would say it's only about five or six inches down, not as deep as the detector said it was, but uh, I'll uh, pull it out and we'll see what date it is, if I, well, if I can get a date. Well, it had me fooled. It was a memorial penny. It seemed a little deeper than the other one, so uh, I don't know. Uh, it played a trick on me. All right, so I'm at this plug, and I would say the target's got to be at least six inches down, at least six inches. And, uh, you know, I dug to the water line here, it looks like, and I'm pretty sure it's silver. It can't be clad when it's this deep, and I'm seeing a glimpse of silver on it. Um, it's underwater there. I'll zoom in close up, and then you can see me pull it out of there. All right, so there's the water hole. Um, I'll pull it out of there. And uh, hopefully it wipes off pretty good. That's... Ooh, those are wings I see. And we have a quarter, a Liberty quarter. That's the first one of these I've ever found. Oh, this is awesome. Um, I'll try to clean it up a little bit more and see if I can't show you a date, if there is a date still on it. But that is awesome, my first one of these. Sweet. All right, so it looks like there is a date on there. I think the last digit's an 8, so it's either like a 1918, 1928 maybe. But uh, I'm not going to try to clean it up too much. I'll clean it up more when I get home, and if I do uh, get the date for it, I will like post it with this clip right underneath here. So, but that's awesome. And this is the only the third plug I dug. The first plug was that wheat penny, the second plug was that memorial penny that I showed you. And then now this one. So awesome. Alright, so I dug another plug and found a 1940 something weedy. I'm here with Merc Man. He's holding the penny right now. And uh, can you flip that over, Merc? So we get a picture of the back, hold it still. And then yep, yeah, one cent weedy. So cool. Okay, so we're at another plug, and we found another wheat penny. It was a 1949, and can't tell if it has a mint mark or not. But it was about four inches down, and uh, well, hopefully we find some more soon. Okay, so we're digging another plug. I think it's a penny. We'll see if it's a wheat penny or not. Let's get this plug up. Thing right about five, I'll say about five inches down. There we go. All right, down at the bottom of the plug. Good sign. Where we go. Oh, a little coin ball, which usually means penny. What could it be? Hopefully it's a dime. No, I see green stuff. So, it's definitely a penny. Ah, it's just a memorial. Ooh, that one looks kind of weird though. 1974. All right. All right, so very good news. On the last plug that we dug, because it's getting dark and Merc Man's got to get to bed, uh, we found a silver quarter. At first I thought it was clad. I'm going to get a close-up of this in a second. Oh, I got to pause it and get a close-up. But um, at first I thought it was clad, but then I'll show you in the close-up. You can see the silver uh, ridge. So, cool. 
All right, so here's the front side of the quarter, 1954. And the stuff is just caked onto it. That's why I thought it was clad at first. And then when I saw like kind of the specs showing through, I was like, well, maybe this is silver. And so then I rubbed the rim of it, and you can see it's all silver. So uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get a mint mark or anything off it. It's got some red stuff on the back, but uh, awesome uh, find. Awesome way to end this hunt. That was our last plug, and now we're heading home.